This is the first question for 25 marks, equivalent to quiz number 4. For the transfer function h of s below, and this one, find its body amplitude plot, both as an approximate not to scale sketch that specifies both the frequency and the decibels at every knee, and also as a proper plot on a semi-log paper attached. Do also that for the phase plot and then find what is the magnitude in decibels and the phase in degrees of that transfer function at a frequency of a radians per second. Let's begin with the amplitude. I begin by identifying the need on the decibels diagram. One at five, there is a pole and a slope for a pole. And then there is a simple zero at 20 and its contribution. And in this pair of complex conjugate poles, there is a knee frequency of 500 radians per second. The slope contribution is negative 40 decibels per decade. The entry on the decibels on the amplitude diagram, of course, because there is a 0 at 0, is 20 decibels per decade. Here it is. The entry curve has a slope of 20 decibels per decade because of this simple zero at zero. At five, this contribution flattens it out. At 20, it takes up again with this slope. And then this minus 40, turning downwards with a final slope of negative 20 decibels per decade. The value of one radians per second, of course, is 20 log of 20 divided five divided 250,000, which is negative 95.92 decibels. From there, we compute the values at all the other knees. We need to compute these decades, and those decades, and these decades up to one kilo radians per second. Now we have computed them. 0.7 decades from one to five, 1.4 decades from 20 to 500, 1.3 decades from 500 to 1,000 radians per second. With the slopes and those decades and distances, we've computed A, B, and C, the climbs and drops, given down here, the three of them. With the value at one, this one, we can compute all the others. Those values are minus 8194 decibels, the value here plus A, and adding B, we get negative 5398 decibels here at the top, and then downwards to a thousand radians per second, we subtract C and get negative 60 decibels, the value in decibels of the transfer function at 1000 radians per second. For the phase diagram, the first thing I do, because we found omega naught 500 radians per second for this pair of complex conjugates, poles, is to find z, 0 0.5 in this case. These are the six knee points. For 5, one at 0.5, another at 50. For this 0 at 20, one at 2, another at 200. And for this pair of complex conjugate poles, with the knee at 500 radians per second, one at 158, and another at 1581 radians per second. The slope contribution for this O1 is 90 divided by Z, 0 0.5. That is 180 degrees per decade. I mark now each one of the knee points, 0 0.5, 52, 200, 158, and 1581, on a scale, with the contributions, of course. This one, minus 45 degrees per decade, and plus 45 degrees per decade, etc., etc. At 158 and 1581, for this pair of complex conjugate poles, the slope is 180 degrees per decade. Downwards on 158, because those are poles, and upwards on 1581 radians per second. 
with the same slope. The entry is going to be 90 degrees because we have a simple zero at zero. Horizontal at 90 degrees. The slopes are entering with 90 degrees minus 45 degrees per day gate, horizontal positive 45 degrees per day gate, negative 135 degrees per day gate, negative 180 degrees per day gate, and horizontal after 1581 radians per second. Then we compute the decades with the slope. We have the drops in this case. A is negative 27 degrees. The value here is 90. The value at this knee 2 is 6291 degrees. We do the same for all the others. 0 0.5, 0 0.1, 0 0.9 decades. And the corresponding drops or climbs B, C, D, B, C, and D appear down here. With those we compute the values at each knee. Here, 85, 39 degrees. In this one, 71, 57 degrees. And finally, the exit value, negative 90.05 degrees. We were asked also to find what was the phase at 1,000 radians per second. Down here, what is the value there? We just use the same technique, the distance from the nearest left knee, which is at 200 to 1,000, is 0.7 decades, with this slope of negative 180 degrees per decade. We compute the drop, this drop, E, negative 125.81 degrees, starting at 71.57, the value here of the phase of the transfer function at a thousand uh, radians per second is negative 54.25 degrees. That is the phase of the transfer function at that frequency. This is the approximate solution on semi-log paper, the one we computed before. And as a reference, I have plotted also the exact phase of that transfer function for each one of the frequencies of interest. However, this red curve was not part of the question in your exam, only the black segmented line. The exact amplitude of the transfer function versus the approximate one that we computed in blue can be seen here.